Hello guys, what is going on? My name is Oxide, and if you're new, welcome, welcome, welcome. Today, I'm going to show you two wall glitches that still work in GTA 5 Online. Now, these glitches are old, and many of you already may know about these, but if you do know about them, but don't know if they're patched or not, they still work, just letting you guys know. And for some of you that don't even know they exist, they do exist. And, uh, I do not know whether or not they will work on next generation consoles or the PC, but it is working on the Xbox 360 and PS3. And these glitches are working as of the posted date. And sorry I've been a little inconsistent on uploads. I'm sorry I've just been a little busy like I said previously. For the first glitch, make your way down to the Pacific Standard Bank. Um, I'm thinking everyone knows where it is since everyone played the heist, but I showed you on the map the, uh, where it is. It's basically to get inside the bank vault and get past the door. Simply walk in the front door, go left, and just follow me. That I guess that's what I said that. Just, just follow me and follow me exactly where my path takes you. And get to the bank vault door thing. Now, if any of you have any questions, comments, or concerns, or anything about anything, let me know, and I'll be sure to answer that, answer your questions, and whatnot. But once you come down here, go in the corner like I did, pull up your phone, go to your jobs list, and select any random mission in there. Make sure it is not like a last team standing or a deathmatch. Uh, it only works in these type of missions right here. But just load into it, and then immediately, or well, not immediately, it, it uh, okay. Just load into it and then back out of it, and then it should spit you right in here. Sorry for messing that up. I'm a little tired. Um, shoot open the bank do door, bank. I guess that's what I get for not sleeping. And then simply walk in and you can do and explore what you want. Make sure to go check out uh, this guy named Call of Duty slash Multi Zombies. He founded the second glitch for me or told me about it, so. Go check him out, his links will be down in the description below. Thanks, buddy. Alright, for the last and second glitch I'm going to show you, this is right by Lester's warehouse. If you don't know who Lester is or where his warehouse is, I'm sorry for you, but just come to this location on the map. You don't need to know if you don't know. Here it is, just go to the location. So, once you go and get in this little area, you see this trash can. Push it up against the back of the wall over there i'll show you what i mean just get a car and then just push it and push it to where it's fully backed up against the, the dumpster and once you push it right up against the wall go ahead and get out of your car and get on top of the dumpster this is fairly simple from here once you're on top of it kind of stand where i'm standing then press x and your guys should climb through the wall and jump down here now, be careful when you're walking in that gray part, non-solid part of it. Uh, you can fall down and fall underneath the map, but it will spawn you back on the street. You can shoot and kill people or do whatever the hell you want, basically. To get out, um, just walk in the gray part and it should spawn you on the street. If you don't want other players following you in that glitch, make sure to uh, put a sticky bomb on that trash can and then blow it up once you're inside. Uh, so other players can't follow you in. Follow you in. God, I don't know if that's really for this video. If you have been watching this far, I want you guys to comment down below. Hashtag GTA 5 wall glitch. Thank you guys for watching. Take it easy. Peace.